Hey guys, LQ here with the LQ Review. Thank you so much for joining me here at my YouTube channel. This is where I talk about all the geeky, nerdy stuff that I love to talk about. Movies, video games, comic books, TV shows, and right now I want to talk about episode 2 of the second season of The Walking Dead, Daryl Dixon, The Book of Carol. And... You know, I wasn't the biggest fan of the first season of Daryl Dixon. I thought that it was kind of boring. I think Daryl definitely is a great character, but I think he's a character that works best when he is paired up with somebody or in a group. And in season one, the focus was all on him, and I just felt like the season was a little boring and that he wasn't able to really carry it. Not that Norman Reedus can't carry a movie or a show, but the character I felt wasn't able to carry the show. And obviously I had very high hopes with Carol coming in because I do feel like she's a very strong character. And the first episode of the book of Carol, I really liked it. My review is up on this channel. You can check it out. I really liked it. I thought it was very well done and it moved at a great pace. And I definitely felt like the stronger moments of the episode were the moments that Carol was in it. And nothing has changed in episode two. Um, I I think that by far the strongest moments of this episode were the episodes with, or sorry, were the scenes that Carol was in, specifically Carol and Ash. Uh, so we know that at the end of the first episode, they take off on the airplane and they're heading toward uh, France, planning to make a pit stop in Greenland. In this episode, we get that pit stop in Greenland. And what happens? Of course, they run into some walkers. They get into some trouble. They get saved by some strangers. But in the Walking Dead universe, strangers are never good. Strangers are always bad. They can never be good people out there. There's always going to be bad people out there. And what they ultimately run into is two women who are doing were doing research in Greenland when all everything fell apart. And they've been stranded there. And now their goal is to save humanity. And how are they going to save humanity? Well, of course, they're going to do that by killing Carol and turning Ash into their um, baby maker. <laughs> that he can, he can, uh, uh, they can use him to make some babies and keep the world going. Um, these women are are very short lived in this show, and that has been one of my biggest gripes with the Walking Dead spinoffs. This is true for Daryl Dixon. This is true for uh, Dead City. This is true for um, um, the Rick and Michonne series. Any new characters that get introduced are being introduced solely so they can be bad and die. That's not really an exaggeration. That's more or less how it's been going in these in these uh, spin-off episodes. And uh, I think that's a real weakness, especially when you get people that you would like to have around for a little while and they're they're not. Not saying that the two women in this in this episode, I, I, I wanted them to be around for a little while. I could have cared less about these two women um, in this episode, but it's a running theme. It's a running thing in, in The Walking Dead now. Meet people, tur they turn out to be bad, they die. <laughs> and uh, it's, it's frustrating. It's a frustrating storytelling trope that Walking Dead is, has got themselves caught in. But ultimately, Carol and Ash do make it to France, uh, and they stash the plane. And Carol talks Ash into waiting with the plane so she can venture out by herself to find her daughter. And, um, you know, we know that, that she doesn't want Ash to go with because of the lie. Um, that she has told him. And she still needs him. She needs him to fly her back. So, um, you know, she wants to be able to not worry about him. And not worry about him finding out the truth and deserting her. All the stuff with Carol was interesting. I was dialed into all of it. Enjoyed all of it. But then we get to the stuff with Daryl. And it's not as interesting. I'm not enjoying myself. It's, 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 it's stuff that... I find a little boring. Uh, in this episode, Laurent gets kidnapped. And uh, Daryl and Isabel, they take a team and they go after him. And they find out that some of the people who they've been working with are actually against them, working with Janae. And um, yeah, it, it's... I don't, I don't know why, but I'm just 
finding the Daryl storyline to be boring. I'm hoping that once Carol gets finds him and they team up and they go to war with Janae and her paramilitary group, that it gets a lot more interesting. Um, and, you know, I would love to see Isabel go back to America with uh, Daryl and Carol. Um, I think some people might not love that, though. I think some people are looking at Isabel as, as a barrier to the Daryl and Carol romance. <laughs> uh, I'm okay with it, though. I'm okay with it. I, I always thought that Daryl and Carol would work best as friends. So, um, yeah, I'm very mixed on this episode. Uh, I think it's it's got more good than bad in it. And there was a decent action sequence at the end of at the end of the episode, um, where Daryl and some of his colleagues, you know, have to have to fight. Um, some of the traders in their group, but overall, I'm just a little mixed on it. The the Daryl storyline I'm not as engaged in as the Carol one, and this episode leaned a little more Daryl than Carol, or I thought episode one leaned a little more Carol than Daryl. So that's my take on episode two. I'm still optimistic that this is going to be a good season. Um, I do hope that uh, they end this season with uh, Daryl and Carol returning to the United States. I am ready for a Walking Dead reunion uh, where all of our spin-off stories come back together. But, um, you know, that's just me. So that's my take on this episode. What did you think of it? Let me know in the comments down below. While you're down there commenting, subscribe to my channel. And until next time, we'll see you guys later.